This is the assembly of a Mark 96 Steriflow valve, a valve line by Richards Industries. This is a Mark 96 being built after pre-assembly. First, take your body with the flange facing you and pull your stem plug assembly through the body. Now, place on your first washer and the lower diaphragm plate with the grooves facing upward. Now, put on your diaphragm and your upper diaphragm plate with the grooves facing downward. Next, you're going to put on your spacer with the notch facing the phalange. You're going to put on your second washer and your cylinder and check to make sure there's resistance against the stem plug assembly. Next, you're going to get out your Loctite and you're going to apply a small amount of Loctite to the jam nut. The jam nut will be placed on the end of the stem plug assembly and push down finger tight Once secure, tighten with a 9 16 standard wrench and an adjustable wrench to hold the stem plug assembly in place while you tighten with a 9 16 Now make sure that everything's secure and non-moving and place your spring on top of the cylinder and your spring housing on top of that with the notch facing directly opposite of the phalange. Next, add food grade anti-seize to each one of the bolts that will be entering the body. You're now going to want to take your adjusting screw and add food grade anti-seize to it also. Lightly turn in the adjusting screw until it stays steady. Now finger tighten each bolt that will be entering the body. Now, take your torque wrench, which is at 200 inch pounds, and start cross torquing each individual bolt. Double check every bolt to make sure all bolts have been cross torqued. Finally, make sure everything's secure and tighten down your adjusting screw. This has been a presentation of the assembly of a Mark 96 Steriflow valve from Richards Industries. Steriflow valve offers many online tools for your easy reference, including installation and maintenance manuals. These are available online at www.stairflowvalve.com. For additional assistance, please go to the help desk or call us at 513-533-5600.